Hello. Uh, I haven't done too many phone lives from from you on YouTube. Not from YouTube. On YouTube. There she is. There she is. So uh, I can't go live yet because, well, the monitor is dead. So we're going to do this tonight for a little bit. Get out of the kitchen. It's messy in here. It's not that messy in here. It's a little messy in here. But it's messy in there. You guys want to see that? There's not many people in here, but that's okay. It's really messy in here. This ends up... Uh. So that's busted. That's broken. That sucks. It needs to... Well, I can't fix it because it's too much money to fix, so... But it's chaos in here. We hosted, so this became a catch-all. And, yeah, so... Stream room is a complete wreck right now. For the sandwich, sir. Welcome in. Lizzie, welcome in as well. Thank you, guys. So Martha's making dinner. There she is. I'm going to paint ornaments. So if uh, you guys remember from last time... Hey, Daisy, how's it going? If you guys remember from last week, uh, I had talked about the fact that we would be doing our Christmas tree. Uh, not this one. That one's much bigger than the one in the office. But we're going to be doing our Christmas tree uh, from now until... <laughs> um, but anyways, uh, we're going to be doing our Christmas tree. And again, Super Chats, uh, new members, uh, gifted members, returning members and direct donations, all that stuff will get you an ornament on the Christmas tree, and I've gotta paint those. So I'm gonna spend some time tonight painting. Um, again, I've not done this live on my phone. Hey guy, what's going on? Thank you for stopping in, I appreciate it. This is not our normal live setup. This is, uh, this is the my system doesn't work setup. So this is what we're doing. So if you guys are new here, cause I know we've had a lot of new friends kind of join the community as of late, it's Wednesday, my dude. Welcome in. Welcome in. This is the setup, the usual setup, and that's broken. So, and that's, unfortunately, I had to replace it. But it won't be in until either the end of the week or maybe, I'm hoping Thursday. Maybe Wednesday. Probably not tomorrow. I can hope, but I'm, it's probably not going to happen. So, I'm going to paint some ornaments. I'm going to hang out with you guys for a little bit. And just try to catch up a little bit because I miss y'all. And yeah, so unfortunate turn of events, but we're just going to roll with it and hang out. And you guys can see me in my I don't want to get paint on nice clothes outfit. So we're going to do that. But we've got some ornaments to paint. If you guys were with us last year, again, on Facebook, if you were with us, we did ornaments. We're going to do... These ones are specifically for gifted members. So if you guys gift memberships... You'll get a present ornament or a stocking ornament or a Santa hat. Boom. I'm going to paint all those. And then I've got a bunch of different ones. We had some from last year. If you guys do any like super chats and stuff, uh, Boss Booga, welcome back. Good to see you. Can you tell Martha I said hello? Mar uh, honey, Lizzie says hi. Ooh. Lizzie. Hi, Lizzie. There you go. She did it. We've got stars, which is, we, we did these last year. The, street, the, the tree last year is primarily stars and hearts because that was the, uh, that was the logos on Facebook. So I got bigger stars this year because we have a bigger tree. So we're gonna paint those yellow. And I have a bunch of these hearts left over from last year, which were the color of the, uh, the subscriber badge or supporter badges over on Facebook last year. And now I don't really know what else to do with them. Emmanuel, welcome in, buddy. Thank you for stopping in. So I might paint some of these, or I might hold on to these for Valentine's Day and see if there's, like, a use for them on Valentine's Day. So I might just do that. We'll see how it goes. And then we've got our random hodgepodge. <laughs> we got bells. We got reindeer. We got snowmen. We got, we got snowflakes. Got all the Christmassy-looking things. So we're just going to take some time and do that, but... Again, I really do apologize, everybody, for uh, the lack of streams this week. I know it's been kind of inconsistent the past few weeks between being sick and vacation and now this. Um, but we're just going to roll with it and make the best of it and try to have uh, good attitudes. And again, just get through it. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. So we're just going to take it as a good thing. I'm going to hang out with my nephew a little bit tonight. 
So some more time with my wife and my family is a good thing. We're just gonna roll with it, so. But if you guys are stopping in and this is your first time, this is not our normal. This tree's gonna be decorated, it's gonna happen. I have faith in you guys. Kitty, do not jump up here. This is not the play, cat. Hi, sir. I don't know if you got, no, you can't see Kitty. He's down here. He's seeking attention now. He saw me sit down. He's like, what are you doing? He's like, what sort of nonsense can I get into with dad? So we're going to start off with our first, sir, you are, you are right in my way. <laughs> Kitty cat wanting to get in the mix of things. So we're going to paint these stars yellow and get that going. And I'm hoping, I want to be live again next week, which we should be. Because we got to do Scara viewer polls, because that's got to happen. I don't think I'm going to be wishing for Scaramouche, to be honest. I think I'm more in line for Phase 2. I want to, but uh, Dodge was sharing uh, Scara's passive today in the uh, Discord. And it's making it real difficult to not want to wish for that character a lot. Because that's, that passive is insane. It's ridiculous. But... I also have a really good chance at getting constellations on Raiden, and I really want that because C2 is insane. Yeah, he's already next week. It's crazy. Next week, Wednesday, I believe. So I've got a, I got a handful of people that want me to, uh, to wish on their banners for them. So I'm hoping that'll be a fun one, and I'm hoping everything should be back and ready. I'm honestly hoping to maybe get a stream or two in this week, but we'll see we'll see what happens so no clue if that's going to happen or not it's going to be completely dependent on if my monitor arrives on time or not what's uh i didn't catch that message it went away so quickly can you resend your message i've not done this from mobile very often so i don't get to see all of your uh messages i don't get like prompts or anything so can i actually click the button let's see Nope, I want live chat. And we've got, yo, Paula, thank you for stopping in. Oh, is that your, uh, if so, tell her I said hello. Yes, that is my wife, Martha. That is Martha. That's hello. her. Hello. I'm there. making dinner That's in her. my Santa Claus apron. That's her. She's making some soup tonight. I'm making soup. Soup season. Soup. Soup season is best season. Soup. It's one of our favorites. As soon as the weather gets cold, all, well, not all soup, but I'm going to be soup. real with you, even when it's hot sometimes and we're super craving it. Yeah, that's true. It's kind of always, soup season's never like off, but there's definitely times when it's on. <laughs> there's definitely times when soup season's on, so, but. So one side done on these, get them all nice and yellow. These things soak up the paint pretty solid too. It turned out really nice last year. I was pretty happy with them. These are like twice the size of what we had last year though, these ones. So I think that the tree will turn out nice. I, I have faith in you guys. We've already got a long list of ornaments to put up. We even have some special requests where I'm gonna have to try to pretend like I'm an actual artist to <laughs> just make some drawings happen. But I'm excited. It's always fun because you get to like actually I don't know, last year I would put right down things that reminded me of certain like people in the community. So that was kind of fun to do that. And like we had community stars too. Like if people couldn't like donate a, enough for an ornament, people would kind of like work together and get an ornament together, um, which was super cool too. But I don't know, it was a fun season and we had a goal, which I need to think of a goal. So do you guys have a goal in mind that we could aim for if we hit, I want to make a, uh, member goal again to see if we can hit a certain amount of members and if we do I want to do a uh, I don't know what I want to do to be honest a special sort of stream or a special like members only night in discord where we like watch a movie together or something so I don't know there's been some some chit chat as to what that could be but I am low on ideas at the moment because YouTube has different policies than Facebook does that I have to be mindful of when I do these things because I can't do like member only giveaways and such I have to include everybody in on it according to YouTube uh, terms of service at least so want to be a good boy and not get strikes on our channel so that we can keep doing what we're doing but thank you guys also for the um, 
all the love on some of the shorts lately. Uh, one of our shorts recently got some good push again, and we've had a lot of uh, new subscribers and stuff to the channel, which has been super cool to see. Uh, haven't been able to go live really since then, so if you're new and you're checking out the live stream from one of those and you're like, what the world is going on? This is not our norm. <laughs> this is this is just for the evening. Probably not even for the full evening, just more to catch up and let you guys know what's up and get excited for the Christmas tree decorating, which I'm excited for it. Uh, by re oh, Reality Taker Easy, have a good one. Thank you for swinging in. Oh, hey, Nightbot. <laughs> I forgot you'd be in here. We're working on our own Christmas tree. It was a busy weekend with the holidays, so we got some of our Christmas tree done, but we got some more to do this week and this weekend, so it'll turn out nice. It'll turn out nice. We got some fun ornaments from friends a few years ago, and Martha's mom made a new ornament, which is super cute, and so we got some cool stuff to put up. It's gonna be cool. It's gonna be nice. It's gonna be nice. So, but the nice thing is too, is when you guys do support the stream, you'll get your own personalized ornament to put up on our stream tree. And I'm excited for that. So we, we pretty much decked out this tiny one from last year. And this bigger one I'm thinking is gonna go really, really awesome. I'm gonna get a lot of, a lot of support on that. Boom. I gotta do the backside of all these bad boys too. Can't forget. Can't forget. Douche. Poof. It's weird streaming from my living room because you guys never see the living room. You guys only see the, the stream room. It's Is you going randomly back and forth in the middle of the camera? Yeah, you're doing stuff. We got a life to live. <laughs> we need to eat food. <laughs> I've been on this weird Resident Evil 8 uh, tangent lately because I started randomly watching Markiplier play through the DLC of Resident Evil 8 and then YouTube recognized that and suggested a bunch of different lore videos for me. So I've been like deep diving into Resident Evil lore the past like 24 hours. Man, it's a freaking doozy. It makes me want to play the games, but I also don't like scary games, so it also makes me not want to play the games. But. <laughs> It's not seeing the lower half of your body. I know, right? I, you, I'm thicker than you. You guys would probably imagine I'm thick mans. I've put on some thickness. You guys are usually just the upper half, or at least a better angle of the upper half. It's you're getting the the real deal today. The real me. <laughs> and Martha in the background. Make it. It's, I wish you guys could smell the food. Uh, so I'm a cool YouTube change. I noticed a mobile app also shows the number of. Oh, I didn't get to see all that. It disappeared too quickly. Ugh. Come back. There we go. Uh, show the member emotes in the emote menu when not a member could instead. Oh yeah, definitely. That's really great. That's super cool to see. I, I'm excited to see them do more stuff like that and kind of show off. Um, more reasons for people to to join and not just uh subscribe especially for their live stuff and that's the one thing that i'm curious about too i think that's my biggest um question with youtube and whether this is the best place for us to stream is how do those numbers affect uh how do those numbers affect um your views as well yo Jarrow team gaming what's going on welcome in thanks for stopping by so that's my curiosity because like a lot of the shorts and stuff get a lot of views and then some of my reaction videos get a lot of views and then the live streams don't get nearly as many, which is fine because it's not a live stream platform, but I'm curious how the numbers affect your overall reach as a channel. So I'm definitely curious. Idiot, welcome back. Welcome in. Sorry, this is what you get. You get me painting ornaments tonight, at least for a little while. We're not going to be live for super long. It's just going to be like a quick like... I don't know, half hour hangout. Well, uh, try and actually go live while we're waiting for the new monitor to come in. But unfortunately, it's coming in through FedEx. So if you're ever your shorts generate money too, I know, and that's huge. That's huge because short, con short form content is honestly like 
my favorite way to make content. I like being live. Live streaming is my favorite thing to do. Um, I like editing, and I think editing is pretty awesome, and I've gotten better at editing, but my passion is still to be live and, and build a community. So to see that um, our live stuff can make highlight shorts that people enjoy and then can also help build some more revenue um, for the channel is gonna be awesome. I'm really excited for that. I kind of wish that that revenue incentive was happening now, but hey, that's all right. It, they're making it, um, it means that shorts are here to stay. So that means shorts are performing well for YouTube. Um, they're incentivizing um, partnership through short creation, which is huge. So it's all like good, good indicators that short form content on YouTube in that format at least is, is here to stay. I don't know. Well, I guess it, yeah, it's here to stay. I feel like I, I think that that type of content is is really just doing well for for a lot of different platforms, and it looks like YouTube's version of it is doing well. So that's good. That's exciting to see, especially since uh, really I don't want to. A I can't afford to hire a long form editor. I've used an editor for a couple of our shorts, which has been awesome. Turtle Monk is super kind and very very talented individual. Um, but to make like, you know, 12 to 20 minute videos is very expensive. I don't understand why Hutao isn't getting a rerun yet. Yeah, I don't either. I don't either. I'm surprised that Ayato is getting the rerun first, to be honest, because it's what, uh, Raiden and Ayato? So, Emmanuel, the one thing that they're going to, I think they're going to do it like TikTok does it, because they can't, like, actually... Um, I don't think they can monetize it per view because you're not going to have, uh, like, um, how to say this? You're not going to have like a pre-roll ad and you're not going to have like ads on the side in banner form because that format just doesn't work for short form stuff. They're probably going to do like TikTok where monetized c creators get kind of put into an overall pool and probably to some degree your viewership's going to matter but it's going to probably be a lump sum that's divvied out uh, based on um viewership mayhaps um so you'll have like ads in between shorts um when people are monetized and well actually you'll probably just have ads in between shorts all in all unless you have premium so Ayaka's awesome. Ayaka's probably my favorite DPS character still. She's freaking crazy good, but I don't know if Hu Tao's gonna be my play style. I want to get her, but she's such a glass cannon that I almost feel like I'm gonna be too reckless with her and I won't. But I also just don't know enough about her to, to really say, but the times that I've used her, I've been impressed, but it hasn't really been a good match with this. Yeah, Shen He as well, for reals. I want to get her weapon badly, but Raiden coming back at least for me is a is a W just because C two would be insane. I'm guaranteed right now, so uh, ra she did have yep last year she released uh, right when I started playing, which was around uh, this time last year. I want to say like literally like I think my year anniversary playing Genshin again was uh, this week, like Thanksgiving week in the states, and when I was getting back into it, Hu Tao was like, I think she had a week or two left on her banner. Cause then Eula came out the following, or were they, no, they weren't at the same time, were they? No. Then Eula came out uh, or re-ran and then it was um, uh, Ido. So yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's one side. Where are we at, you guys? I think they said they collect all the revenue in the industry. I is going to split. Yeah, so, yeah, they're going to split it, and then I think it's going to get divvied up, probably dependent on how many times your video got played alongside of an ad or was seen with somebody who had, like, encountered those ads. All I care about at this point as a creator is that if I can make a little bit of money on the content that I'm putting out, that's awesome. And I'm any bit of it really does help and give us more opportunity to stream and make more videos. Um, so it's all a win in the end. I'm not going to be like super greedy about it. I'm not trying to make, you know, a bajillion dollars doing this. I just want to like be able to provide for my family and do this and continue to um, 
put some attention on it. You know, as long as we're doing enough to do that, I'm I'm pretty pretty content. Um, but that would be solid to see that happen. So we'll find out as it as it rolls out and see how it goes. Because really, I mean, even when you're doing, I don't I don't monetize even a lot of mine, a lot of my normal videos either. So bad at wind trace, I don't. <laughs> I'm actually I did wind trace when it was out last time, and I didn't really get to put too much energy into it. But I think it might be fun to do something with like members or something to if people want to get in and, and do a couple wind trace matches, maybe dedicate a night to it when it returns. I think that'd be, that could be really fun, depending on how uh, how it goes. I, I feel like for fun, people think it's a, a fun thing to do for, you know, a week or something. But maybe we'll just pick a night and go for it. Were you able to keep a stable number uh, member amount recently? Is that what you said? These comments go away super fast. Keep a stable member amount recently. So our member amount went up substantially when we did the 24 hour stream at the end of September. So at the end of September, I did a September member stream a thon for 24 hours. Um, and we went up to, I want to say at the peak, we were at 225 members. I want to say like 225 or something. Um, once that month was over, it dropped pretty significantly, <laughs> which I was expecting because a lot of those were gifted members and a lot of those were for people that had never even been in the stream because luckily YouTube had fixed, uh, for the most part, gifted members and it wasn't even like people that have been active in the stream. It was actually dishing them out to, uh, to people that either had only been lurking in the stream or, or whatnot. Uh, can cause stability ability to participate. Yeah, I'm ex Yeah, I think it'll be cool. I think it'll be a good, uh, a good mini game to do and, and have some fun with the community for a night. I think that's one thing I want to do more is not just always do the same old, same old with Genshin. I want to try and get, get some, st like the stuff I'm going to do with Samizar. Unfortunately, tonight was supposed to be our, uh, our, um, versus stream. We were going to do a spiral race. Uh, versus one another so we're gonna have to move that to next week so i want to try and start doing some more like actual content stuff but when it comes to our membership um we had like 225 something like that and then it dropped drastically after the month because again um it was gifts were went out to people who weren't super active in the community people that didn't have auto renew set um but we're roughly around where are we at right now i think at least the other day we were back to like 115, 120 um, members. So we've been really staying between like 90 and like 125 is kind of where we've been at with, uh, with our membership here. It's been relatively steady. And on Facebook, I was at the peak, I think I had like 90 members, but I would say on Facebook, my average um, was like 60 to 75. Um, but on Facebook, you did get to keep 100% of the revenue of, of their subscriptions or their memberships. And uh, I didn't have gifted members. So that's, uh, that's the one thing that we do have on YouTube is we have gifted members. So we're not having as many people um, join on their own, but we're having um, people choose to support uh, by gifting out memberships, which I think is honestly one of the best ways that you can honestly uh, support the channel is is through gifted memberships because it shows people the the bonuses you get with emotes and extra streams um if those ever come back or like member only chats and stuff so yo michael what's going on man thanks for stopping in dude sorry uh i haven't been able to be live my monitor broke so i'll give you guys the story on that um i'm not streaming from my computer tonight because uh my monitor is busted unfortunately and monitors sadly are not worth um fixing they're actually almost more expensive to fix than they are to replace so um i went to a land party with some friends this weekend thank you paula for being here by the way thank you thank you i always appreciate it um i went to a land party this weekend with some friends and took my stuff over there Alicia, yo, what's going on? Sorry, yellow paint. I'm painting our, uh, Alicia, do you remember this? We did ornaments last year. I'm painting our star ornaments for Super Chats for the stream tree. Um, so went to the land party and I left early. I didn't stay the night. I ended up leaving at like three in the morning 
and I was so tired and another friend of mine um, needed like a computer to play on because the one they brought was just kind of crappy unfortunately and so I left my stuff there Aiden what's going on man yeah we're gonna be doing that again so we've actually already got a list going for people that have um, joined and sent um, super chats and stuff so we'll already have some ornaments going up um, the first day that we're back uh, live from the stream stuff from the from the actual computer um, so yeah I left my stuff there and James who's like my best friend friggin <laughs> he's like hey man um, the next day he called me and he was like hey what time are you picking up your stuff and I was like oh this afternoon or this evening after we get done with my family stuff He's like, well, I need to talk to you. I was like, what's up? He goes, well, I wanted to be nice and bring all your stuff down. Yo, thank you for the four months, Michael. I'm glad to see that pops up. I On the phone, I didn't know how that works. So let's go, milestone. I'll have to write that down on the list so that you can get your your milestone ornament on the tree. Um, so he, was, he messaged me and he's like, I was trying to be nice and bring all your stuff downstairs so that you could just grab it and load it up quick and not have to like, you know, lug it all up and down the stairs again. And he's like, I hit your monitor on something and it actually like <laughs> killed a bunch of pixels in your screen. And I was like, oh no. He's like, yeah, it's like, you know, it's just a line from up and down. He's like, I'm really sorry, man. He's like, I'm gonna help, like, I'll pay for it and, and help you out and stuff. And I was like, well, I appreciate it, dude. Um, but let me go and get it. And he turned it on and it was like, it didn't, I mean, it's still, it sucks. It's not fun, but like the part, like the top part had a few dead pixels and then there was a big giant deadline of pixels going down the whole thing. I was like, okay. I was like, I can muscle through this for a couple days. I was like, I'm going to order the replacement right now. I'll muscle through using, you know, the, the broken monitor for a couple days. Like it'll be fine. We'll be able to still stream. And I got home and I plugged everything in. And as soon as I like actually pulled up a program and didn't just have the monitor on, it just started flickering and distorting and everything went everywhere. And yeah, it's, it's, oh man. So like, I was like, there's no way I can use this to actually like play video games. So, so unfortunately <laughs> we are, we are stream. Well, I shouldn't say streamless cause we're streaming right now. Um, the, the computer is uh, just not, usable right now until we get that monitor in and I called a few friends um, that work in like the repair the electronic repair industry and they're just like unfortunately um, <laughs> unfortunately monitors are more expensive to fix than they are to just buy new ones so and places like never buy um, buy old monitors so you're just kind of like not SOL but like just get a replacement, man. So yeah, it's a big oof. It's a big oof. And and again, it's not something I'm upset about or like mad about. Like it's super unfortunate, of course, but like it's not like somebody got hammered and like threw my monitor against a wall or anything. It's literally like one of my best friends being like, hey man, I was trying to do you a super solid and kind of just biffed it. And it's literally like just a tiny, tiny little crack. Nim, hello Nim. Welcome to my humble abode. Our, our, oh wait, this is what, I, this is why I had it like this. There we go. Our naked tree, our naked tree. So yeah, so sad about it. I didn't see what Michael said, hold up. Crap happens, but yeah, oh yeah, it sucks. It's, it especially sucks when it's a $300 fix, so. All right, Wednesday, take your easy, homie. Thank you, yeah, it's quaint. It's a quaint little nice home. We like our house. We want a bigger one, especially when we start trying to have a family. We really want to host stuff. We really, really, really want to host uh, uh, like family and stuff. And we do a little bit already, but our house isn't really good for like staying the night and, and whatnot. We don't have a dining room. So we want to get a bigger home one day so we can have our family over and host things like Christmas and Thanksgiving more frequently. And yeah, so. The reason why I haven't had a desktop set up for six days be fun. Yeah, it's it's rough. Yeah, I was right. It well the unfortunate thing is that wall is where like the oven is and everything. So yeah, the one with the Christmas tree. So it's just like yeah. It's not a it's it's like a house from uh I wanna say maybe seventies, fifties or seventies. So not very open concept here. It's it's pretty like each room is its own thing, so, but it's cozy. 
I suppose I should just keep on keeping on and do the other side. So, okay, we're gonna flip to the other side. So we're gonna get these stars done. What time is it? Does anybody know what time it is? So yeah, it's, it's unfortunate with the monitor thing. I bought it last year, so it lasted about a year. Um, and again, James said he'd help me out with it, of course. He wants to make it right, but still, a $300 fix is, is not, uh, was not anticipated at this point in time of the year. But hey, we'll just make the best of it and do what we can. So, more incentive for the Christmas tree. 604. Okay, so it's, yeah, 604 for me too. Uh, does the tree looking got gangster going? <laughs> the tree needs a few more lights, and we haven't put our ornaments up yet. So our tree here is a little barren at the moment, but we like we like the uh, multicolored lights. The more like festive, old school look is what we like for ours. But we do have one ornament. We have Martha's mom made us this cute little like Santa face out of a uh, yarn or something. It actually turned out really really cute. Roll with the punches, yeah, man, he got to. And like I said, it was, it was, it was like, it was legit, like a nice thing. Jason, what's up, man? I'm excited for D and D in a couple weekends. I miss you guys. I got to get you your luggage back. Thank you again for that. <laughs> so yeah, it was like if it was like somebody was being a a, a jerk and just freaking like wasn't even paying attention and got like hammered or something. Like the only thing we were drinking was freaking G fuel and and sugar water. So. <laughs> It's, it is what it is, but it was just a buddy trying to do a nice thing, and it just unfortunately happened. So, but that's all. We'll roll with it. We'll make it work. But so, but I was really looking forward to playing some freaking Pokemon on Monday. I was gonna play Pokemon on Monday, and then tonight was gonna be that uh, special stream with uh, Samizard doing the Spiral Abyss race. So I was really looking forward to that, though. I freaking want to keep playing Pokemon. Sorry, you know, when things are tight in the bay. <laughs> yep. Sometimes, man. Well, and also, too, I think it just kind of tempers your your mentality, too, and helps you, like, realize what's important. And it's like, you know, he's, like, I know James was gutted over this, too. Like, not to keep bringing it up. Fernando, welcome in. Pokemon Abyss? Oh, could you imagine? Pokemon was going to be on Monday, which we didn't get to stream. And then tonight was going to be Spiral Abyss with Samazar doing a race. To see who could 36 star at first. And I was looking forward to it. A little friendly competition. But like James, my buddy was straight gutted. Like he was so bummed out. He like, like, I, yeah. I don't have to keep bringing it up. But he was so bummed. So bummed. But love that dude. He's one of my best. Absolute freaking stellar human being. But also, like I said, just kind of reminds you what's important. It's like I'd rather my friend, you know my friend be happy and not feel so out of it. So, so we have Samizard. Ah, Nim, for four months. Thank you, friend. Membership renewal. Let's go. The milestone. I'll have to write down you and Michael both. You're both going to get uh, get member ornaments on the tree when we finally go live from the office. And hopefully either end of this week or beginning of next. Man, my fingers are getting... I'm not an artiste. I'm not an artiste. I think you guys can roll. I think I think Nightbot is is good enough to roll. I think it's on here. And I missed something else. I'm gonna get paint on my freaking Nim. And speaking of Sam's art, I think he's uh, rehearsing for the this way. He posted his team on Discord recently. Yeah, I honestly I was gonna. I don't want to say do the same thing, but do the same thing. I was gonna go through and at least have my teams planned out. So that uh, I could go in and not have to sit there and be like, well, should I use my freeze comp? Should I do this comp? What should I do? So, um, I asked about everything you've gotten from Zion and FedEx. Yeah, it's so that's the thing too. That's what I'm not pumped about is the monitors coming through FedEx, which I got this. It's the same exact company that I got my current monitor from, and it turned out great. And it did arrive, I remember it arrived earlier than I anticipated, but it is FedEx, which I'm not pumped about. I've not had very good experiences with FedEx in the past, to be honest. Not very good experiences, so I'm hoping this one proves me proves me wrong, because freaking FedEx has done me dirty a couple times. I don't really prefer them. Sorry, FedEx, you don't sponsor me. <laughs> 
Let's go here. Boop. So we're gonna try and we got a lot of of support already on the Christmas tree. Uh, child is uh, character in level ninety. Nice. And that stuff is not great in general with uh, with what do you say? With the tech stuff, yeah, it's it can be hit or miss. I've I've luckily been pretty fortunate um, with the tech stuff. Like I said, my monitor last year came in and it was fine, so that was good. <laughs> Um, I'm just hoping that, um, I think the thing that's scariest is, is when they leave, like the monitor last year showed up in the monitor box. So it wasn't in its own box. It was actually in the box that the monitor comes in. So like when they left it on my porch, it straight up said Asus ROG 1440, 1400 Hertz monitor or whatever, like right on the package. So somebody could have just straight up ganked it. <laughs> I'm like, oh, well, looks like I got a gaming monitor now. Like, frick. So, <laughs> yeah. But luckily, I live in a pretty quiet neighborhood. Like, there's not a ton going on in our neighborhood at all. But it's still concerning when you're like, oh, great. It's not in, like, a blank FedEx box or blank Amazon box. It legit is the packaging box that tells you exactly what it is. Sam, what's up, man? How are you, sir? I hope you're well. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate you. So I'm gonna have, so I'm gonna go over and help my nephew with uh, getting his, his PC has been burning up and I guess the case for his pre-build is notorious for it. So and you know that the one from A to Z, oh, let me, these things go way too quick. I can't read. Our Amazon logo means Almost everything from A to Z, that makes sense. I remember, I'm so old, I remember when Amazon was a bookstore. Amazon was an online book selling company. That's it, that's it. Uh, I'm all right, man, I'm all right. I'm streaming from my phone because my monitor's busted. So I'm just kinda, just wanted to go live for a little bit because I missed everybody and I wanted to give an update because it's been kind of a wonky, like honestly, like eight weeks between vacation and being sick. So just wanted to hop on quick while I was working on this. Martha was making some dinner in the background too. I think she went to off to chill out for a little bit while that's all getting finished. Oh man, these are taking longer than I expected. Yeah, man, unfortunate. It was a, it was just an, it was an accident. My monitor breaking, it was a complete accident, but, uh, Still very unfortunate, <laughs> very unfortunate. So, but that's all right, we make do. Yeah, it was straight up online Barnes and Nobles, man. That was it, all they did was books. I don't know if they acquired Zappos or something that kind of got them outside of books, but yeah, it was all just book purchases. Which is crazy, back in the day. And it just became this freaking monolithic empire <laughs> that now makes Lord of the Rings. Yeah, Netflix. <laughs> Netflix sent you DVDs for reals. Goodness, how things have changed. It's crazy. I mean, in my lifetime alone, I remember life without the internet. Like, that's how old I am. I remember, I remember getting the internet. I remember in third grade, my dad got us the internet, and I remember sitting on the computer looking up websites with him for the first time and being like, what is this? The computer is so different. It's so different now. I'm not just playing like friggin' solitaire and minesweeper now. I'm, you know, I'm actually like looking up information. It was, it was brilliant. I remember my dad was super into NASCAR and I remember him pulling up the NASCAR website being like, look at this. You can look up all our all your favorite racers, which I didn't care for NASCAR at all. I didn't really love NASCAR. My dad did, so I tried to like it. So, Geo, yeah, Neopets, Club Penguin. Gosh. Did someone say Neopets? Someone said Neopets. You got Martha's attention. I love Neopets. She loves Neopets. Up. I said something. I want to see that. Remember getting Cowbox for the first time? Oh, are you talking about the Gateway computers? <laughs> and it had the pin. Yes, it had pinball on it pre-installed pinball game on the uh, gateway cow boxes my mom after my parents split i begged and begged and begged my mom because my dad was a huge computer guy and then when he moved out obviously he took the computer with him so 
I remember homeworks being late because we have <laughs> Yep, exactly. And uh, I begged and begged and begged my mother for a computer. And we bought a gateway desktop that was on sale for $8.99 or something stupid like that. So, Brinks, welcome back in, friend. Good to see you. Thank you for being here. Sorry it's not a normal live stream, but I'm glad you stopped by. But yeah, the, the freaking cow box. I forgot about the cow box. I never got a Club Penguin account. I never had Club Penguin or Neopets. That was a little bit uh, after my time. But Martha, that's her jam. That was her jam. Big, big fan. Well, I'm glad, I'm glad that you don't care. I'm actually doing our the ornaments for the the tree that we have in the stream room. So every year I do a tree in the stream room and people can get personalized ornaments on it by sending star super chats, gifting members, becoming a member, renewing their membership, all that fun stuff. So um, that's what we're doing tonight is working on that. I think I saw Aiden say something. Uh, those massive brick of monitor that weighed like 50 pounds. Oh dude, for real, man. I remember pre-Windows. My dad had a computer that had that didn't that didn't even run on Windows. It was like a glorified version of DOS. And I remember that you would load it up and it'd have a blue screen with a bunch of titles and letters on it, and you would hit the letter for the program you wanted. And I played this Jack Nicholson freaking nineteen ninety three PGA tour video game on it, and I loved it. I would golf on that thing all the time. Loved it. Loved that stupid game. I wish I could find that game. It's probably on the internet somewhere. I'd have to look it up. Was it Lennox? You're probably right. I was. I don't remember what it was, but it was just a blue screen with letters. That's all I remember. Yep. And then I'd play that game. And then we got Windows on one of his computers. And then I could play like Solitaire and Minesweeper. And I still don't know to this day how to play freaking Minesweeper. I want to learn. I want to learn. Kaiser, thank you for stopping in. I really want to learn how to play Minesweeper. I've never beaten a level of Minesweeper. So we got three stars left. Three stars left. Then I might end the stream and concentrate on getting some of these gifted member ornaments done. Because we've got the hats, we've got the gifts, and we've got the stockings. And I kind of want to try and gussy those up a little bit. I want to paint them red and white i think it literally is vhs oh was, yeah it is let me see there's uh, reasons for that <laughs> dude one of my favorite chris my favorite birthday presents i had a text play this rough rpg oh text-based rough rpg it was my favorite it was graphics and all text oh yeah dude that stuff was the jam back in the day um again to date myself it was my sixth birthday party house review i mean i could give you a, a slight tour of the home. <laughs> this is the living room. That's the kitchen. Stream room's over there too. Our house is very modest. It's, we love our home though. We love it. Um, I, what was I talking about? Goodness. Oh yes. To date myself. I think it was my sixth birthday. It was at a McDonald's and I was given uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2 Secret of the Ooze on VHS. And I was pumped. I was so pumped. I was beyond pumped. I was really, really stoked about it. So that dates me. Good old VHS tapes. We had, my cousins and I were so desperate when they first moved to town. We didn't have cable and we get we got stuck alone a lot because the parents were trying to move stuff that we didn't have a VCR that would rewound. But we noticed that every time you ejected the VHS, it, re it would automatically rewind like 30 seconds. So we did that for the entirety of the Titanic VHSs. Oh yeah, dude, I did see the Oregon Trail, um, the Oregon Trail uh, remake. It actually does look really good. Is that gonna be on PC, Switch, or everything? Because it looks sick. It actually looks really, really dope. I think that star's done. That yeah, star's done. Or they gotta dry at least. Oh no, one more, one more. My character's created, which is my profile picture, is trapped inside of VHS. Yeah, there's a remake of Oregon, Oregon Trail coming out. Lovely and rattle, very much a name. My turtle Leo, one of my favorites. Uh, go Ninja, go Ninja, go for like a vanilla ice. All right, idiot Akko, take care, homie. You did great. They're all right, yeah, they did good. Oh, my fingers are yellow. 
Got yellow fingers now. There she is. There's a standing here lurking him out. <laughs> it's my handy. Hold on a second, hold on a second, hold on a second. There it is. There's the lurk emote. <laughs> Perfection. <laughs> Dinner's gonna be done soon. Okay. I'm gonna end here in a few moments. I'm just gonna get this last one done and then eat and hopefully get a few more ornaments done before the end of the night. I wanna because I don't think it, I don't think the monitor is gonna be in tomorrow. And even if it is in tomorrow, that means I have to get the room set up still too. So I don't think there won't be a stream tomorrow, the earliest. We could have a stream is probably Thursday, and that's if we got the monitor tomorrow. So there's just a good chance we're not going to have any streams the rest of the week, unfortunately. Um, if we can even just have one on Friday, I'm going to try and do it, but I really want to get through that Archon quest really bad, <laughs> but and I want to get to the tree decorating, but don't have the equipment, you don't have the equipment. That is what it is, so... But again, just to remind you guys, gifted members, if you gift a member, you will get a, this will be painted, and I will also be drawing and writing your names on these, so when you do it, I'll write your name on it, and I might like draw something on the other side of it um, that represents you, or makes me think about you, or write something on there. Um, so there's that one. The stocking is also for gifted members. And then I think the Santa hat is going to be for gifted members too, depending on... It'll be interesting to see how people choose to want to decorate the tree. So gifted members will have random ones. Super chats will pretty much all be stars because that's the logo. And I still got these bad boys from Facebook. If you guys remember Facebook, this is what we you got if you, uh, excuse me, became a supporter on Facebook back when we did this last year. So. Um, I would have to go look at my list, to be honest, Lizzie. I would have to look. I wrote down everybody's name that uh, sent a super chat or did anything um, those last couple days um, before, yeah, before the weekend. My hand is, here, let me see. I'll do like, not a full, not a full house tour, but like a little house tour, because there's got to be some mystery in the world. Ugh. There we go. So, TV, bookshelf, creepy Santas that Martha loves. Our, our tree that we need to get more lights for. Um, let's see what else. Oh, all my nonsensical stuff. Those things. Kitchen's a bit messy. But we got spoop. We got kitchen. That is the bathroom. That is the stream room. I'm watching TikToks in the dark. She's watching TikToks in the dark. So that's what's happening in there. And the stream room is a chaotic wait, wait, mess. Wait, 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 bring it down here. Bring it down here. Bring it down here. Mm, get a good whiff of that. Soup. 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 Are you, Soup. Are you just showing people the house? If they wanted to see a little bit. When it looks like this? Yeah, it looks crazy. Uh, yeah, guess. the stream room looks disgusting. So we've we this have. This is hundred percent Marx's room, so don't even. Yeah, no, this is all me. No, this is what it, what kind of soup is it, honey? So it's supposed to be pasta vajol. Pasta vajol. They didn't have the didoli noodles, however you say it, the store. So I use elbow macaroni. Okay, so pasta vajol with a different type of pasta. Yeah. So that's what it is. So stream room, you guys are most acquainted with this place. So this is the setup. This monitor, the one right here, that's the busted one. The one standing up and down is fine. Um, but yeah, there's the tree that we'll be decorating. And then there's a cat with a vacuum, all of our laundry hanging up. And then It looks like him and the vacuum are like best friends and they're snuggling. They are snuggling. Kitty really <laughs> loves the vacuum. Does not. Kitty really loves the vacuum. And then this is just the chaos that is I'm trying to get a house organized after hosting for a weekend and then realizing that your your closet in here has not enough space for all the nonsense that you have. So I'm going to have to literally go through this whole closet and get it all taken care of because usually if there is mess in here, it's all located on top of that organized. Um, but that thing, the closet, we don't want to look at the closet. The closet is a nightmare. It's just a chaotic nightmare. Okay, cat.
Good boy. It's a cat. Don't worry, fingers were already dry. I didn't put paint on my cat. <laughs> I'm not that cruel. Um, yeah, so that's it. Living room. Um, we had to rearrange it a little bit to make some more space for the tree. Um, don't mind the curtains. They're gray and dumb. So, then, yeah, that's it. Bedroom. Bathroom. Stuff. So, is that a Ginzo? Oh, it's a Ginzo. Hold up. Oh, that's the good stuff right there, buddy. This is what he loves to do. Just sleep. All day. All day. <laughs> All right. That's it. I will catch you guys sometime soon. Um, Discord, I'll post on here. Twitter, Twitter's a good place to keep track of what's going on. I'll post on there. But if you don't hear from me that I'm going live, just assume that I'm not until you hear otherwise. So hopefully the monitor comes in tomorrow. If it does, we'll hopefully be live Thursday. If it comes in Thursday, hopefully we'll be live Friday morning. If it doesn't come in until Friday, then... I'll see you Monday. <laughs> so I um, appreciate you guys being patient and being understanding while well, everything's kind of been up in the air lately. And I just appreciate y'all very, very much. So have a good night and excited to stream again soon. See you guys.